1962 RCA Victor round tube color TV console with phonograph. Here's the tuner chassis. Tuning eye. Only bad thing about this is the TV is missing. I don't know what this would have been if this would have been a CTC, maybe a CTC 12 or CTC 11. Would have originally had a round color set in there, but looks like somebody retrofitted in another type of TV at one time. Maybe I can get a, uh, I think I've got a CTC-15 with a bad cabinet, so I may be able to get the escutcheon off of it and actually put a round set back in there. Let's take a look now at the amplifier. Looks like there's been evidence of some tube replacements. You can see Magnavox tubes in there. And then the modern RCA logo on this 5AS4 tube. I don't know what makes that different from a 5U4. That's what it looks like. Must be something that makes it special. And let's get a date code check here. And let's see here. 6224. It's got, looks like it's got 12 inch woofers and just cone type tweeters. Here's the tuner chassis. Here's the tube layout diagram. Here's the, the uh, amp. Here's the tuner. I really like this cabinet. I'm not gonna I'm not going to dump this cabinet or anything because I, I really like the way it looks. Even if I can't find a TV, I'd like to get this all restored working in working condition. It probably would work if I tried it, but I still just want to replace these caps before I do, just to avoid the possibility of a short. Here's some model and serial number data. If DRH4683 is watching this, he could probably tell me what this, uh, what this model correlates to. I sort of know what these codes represent, but not completely. Look at that, 570 watts drawn off the AC line. It's a lot of heat produced by all those tubes. Somebody just removed the tube cap and covered it with something when they retrofitted the new TV in there.